يا ابانا الذي في السماوات يتقدس اسمك ياتي ملكوتك تكون مشيئه كما في السماء كذلك على الارض وبزنا كفتنا عاطينا اليوم واغفر لنا ذنوبنا كما نغفر نحن ايضا المذنبين الينا ولا تدخلنا في تجربه لكن نجينا من الشرير قل المسيح يا صار ربنا ان لك الملك Mar in Sihor of Hos and Tefarier on Hen Boy with no boy. Nimne Hotir on Teb and on Hanerin, even in Jibi Pantocrato. Oh, the choice of an oti. Rose of Exhausty, Kiriel. If me, the choice of no zippy Pantocrato. If you have been choice, so open not your open so tiri so. Oh, be Christos, we thank you for everything concerning everything and in everything. For you have covered us, helped us, guarded us, accepted us to yourself, spared us, supported us, and have brought us to this hour. That God may have mercy and compassion upon us, hear us, help us, and accept the supplications and prayers of His saints for that which is good on our behalf at all times, and forgive us our sins. Lord, have mercy. <laughs> Can entreat your goodness, O lover of mankind, grant us to complete this holy day and all the days of our life and all peace with your fear. O land be all temptation, all the work of Satan, the counsel of wicked men, and the riding of enemies hidden and manifesting. They were away from us and from. And from this holy place, but do things which are good and profitable to provide for us. For it is you who have given us the authority to tread in serpents and scorpions, and up for not a part of the enemy. يا الله الذي قبل لي القربين هذه لسبب قلبي عبد الله لي فاز الدخول من ايدينا نحن خطر عبد الله ربنا اسمعنا الله ربنا اسمعنا الله ربنا
Again, let us ask God, the one to reward the Father of our Lord, God and Savior, Jesus Christ. We ask and entreat your goodness, O lover of mankind. Remember all the sick among your people. and brethren who are sick with any sickness whether in this place or in any place that Christ our God may grant us with them health and healing and forgive us our sins Lord have mercy you have visited them with mercy and compassion heal them take away from them and from us every sickness and every malady and the spirit of the sickness just away. Those who have long lain in maladies raise up and comfort. Those who are afflicted by unclean spirits set them all free. Those who are in the prisons or dungeon, those who are in exile or captivity, or those who are held in bitter bondage. O Lord, set them all free and have mercy upon them. For you are he who loosens the bond, the bond and lift up the fallen, the hope of those who have no hope, and the help of those who have no helper, the comfort of the faithless and the horror of the those in the storm, also that are distressed or bound, grant them mercy, O Lord, grant them rest, grant them refreshment, grant them grace, grant them hope, grant them salvation, grant them the forgiveness of their sins, and their iniquities as for us too o lord the sickness of our souls heal and also those of our bodies cure o you the true physician of our souls and bodies the bishop of all flesh visit us with your salvation lord have mercy we ask and entreat your goodness o lover of mankind remember o lord our father our brethren who are traveling lord have mercy and those who intend to travel anywhere straight in all their ways whether by sea rivers lakes roads or those who are traveling by any other means everyone anywhere lead them into a heaven of calm a heaven of safety graciously accompany them in their departure and be their companion in their travel bring them back to their own rejoicing with joy and safe and security be a fellow worker with you servants in every good deed as for us to all lords to keep our sojourn in this life without harm without a storm and Undisturb it to the end. Lord have mercy. Let's praise the angel saying, Glory to God in the highest, peace on earth and goodwill towards men. We praise you, we bless you, we serve you, we worship you, we confess to you, we glorify you. We give thanks to you for your great glory, O Lord, Heavenly King, God the Father, the Pantocrator, O Lord, the only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. O Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, who takes away the sins of the world, receive our prayers. You who sits at the right hand of the Father, have mercy on us. You, for you only are holy. You only are the Lord, O Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. Glory to God the Father. Amen. Every day I will bless you, I will praise your name forever, yes, forever and ever, amen. From the night season my soul awakes early unto you, O my God, for your precepts are a light upon the earth, I continually pursue your ways, for you have become a help unto me. My voice shall you hear in the morning, early will I stand before you, and you shall see me. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, who is born of the Virgin, have mercy upon us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, who is crucified for our sake, have mercy upon us. Holy God, Holy Mighty, Holy Immortal, who rose from the dead and ascended into the heavens, have mercy upon us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and always, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, remit our sins. O Lord, pardon our iniquities. O Lord, forgive us our trespasses. 
O Lord, visit the sick of your people, heal them for the sake of your holy name. Our fathers and brethren who have slept, O Lord, repose their souls. O you who are sinless, Lord, have mercy on us. O you who are sinless, Lord, help us and receive our supplications. For yours is the glory, the dominion, and true holiness. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, bless us. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, for thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Hail to, to the Holy Virgin who has brought forth unto us the true light Christ our God. Ask the Lord on our behalf that he may have mercy on us and forgive us our sins. O Virgin Mary, the Holy Theotokos, the faithful advocate for all mankind, intercede on our behalf before Christ, whom you have brought forth, that he may forgive us our sins. Shere neoti barthenos te oro emmi analithini, shere mshoshon te vengenos aregvon aninimmanuil, Tenti huari pen mevi, oti ebros tati se tenot. Narem ben shois isos becheres tos, and tefkane novi na nebul. Fasting and prayer are the salvation of our souls. Purity and righteousness, they are what pleases God. Fasting has raised Moses up to the mountain until he received the law for us from the Lord our God. Fasting has raised Elijah up to heaven and has saved Daniel from the den of lions. Our Lord Jesus Christ fasted for us Forty days and forty nights to save us from our sins, and we too let us fast with purity and righteousness, and let us pray, proclaiming and saying, Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, for thine is the glory for ever. Arbresve bine reie gono te chosne perenti te otokos Mareias maven ben sotir en tefkane novi na nebol Arbresve bine reie gon Obe arshi angelos et o em Michaele ba arkon en nani fio en tefkane novi na nebol Tome me pshoi se reie gon Opitheore mos nevangelestis, Marcos vi apostolos, nte fkane novi na nebol, tove me pshoi se reiegon, obi arshi diakone tes marotes, Stefanos vi shorbem martiros, nte fkane novi na nebol, tove me pshoi se reiegon, Ona shoin seni o te maino shiri ava vi shoin ma ava bavlin te fkane novi na nebol. Be our advocate in the highest where you are, a lady of us all the Theotokos, the ever Virgin Mary. Ask of him whom you have borne, our good Saviour, to take away our afflictions and accord to us his peace. Hail to you, O Virgin, the very and true Queen. Hail to the pride of our race, was born to us, Emmanuel. We ask you, remember us. O our faithful advocate before our Lord Jesus Christ, that he may forgive us our sins. We honor you, Mother of true light, and glorify you, O Holy Virgin, Mother of God, for you gave birth to the Savior of the world. He came and saved our souls. 
Glory to you, our Master and King Jesus Christ, pride of the apostles, crown of the martyrs, joy of the righteous, steadiness of the churches, remission of sins. We preach the Holy Trinity, the one divinity, whom we worship and honor. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord bless us, amen. Truly we believe in one God, God the Father, the Pantocrator, who created heaven and earth and all things seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten of the Father before all ages, light of lights, true God of true God, begotten not created, co-essential with the Father, by whom all things were made, who for us men and for our salvation came down from heaven and was incarnate of the Holy Spirit and of the Virgin Mary and became man. And he was crucified for us under Pontius Pilate, suffered and was buried, and on the third day he rose from the dead, according to the scriptures, ascended into the heavens. He sits at the right hand of his Father, and he is coming again in his glory to judge the living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. Yes, we believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the life giver, who proceeds from the Father, who with the Father and Son is worshipped and glorified, who spoke by the prophets, and in one holy, catholic, and apostolic church, we confess one baptism for for the remission of sins. We look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the coming age of A reading from the book of Exodus of Moses the prophet, may his blessings be with us all. Amen. And the Lord said to Moses, Rise early in the morning and stand before Pharaoh as he comes out of the water, out to the water. Then say to him, Thus says the Lord, Let my people go, that they may serve me. Or else, if you will not let my people go, behold, I will send swarms of flies on you and your servants, on your people and into your houses. The houses of the Egyptians shall be full of swarms of flies, and also the ground on which they stand. And in that day I will set apart the land of Goshen, in which my people dwell, that no swarms of flies shall be there, in order that you may know that I am the Lord in the midst of the land. I will make a difference between my people and your people. Tomorrow this sign shall be, and the Lord did so. Thick swarms of flies came into the house of Pharaoh, into his servants' houses, and into all the land of Egypt. 
The land was corrupted because of the swarm, swarms of flies. Then Pharaoh called for Moses and Aaron and said, Go sacrifice to your God in the land. And Moses said, It is not right to do so, for, for we would be sacrificing the abomination of the Egyptians to the Lord our God. If we sacrifice the abomination of the Egyptians before their eyes, then, then will they not stone us? We will go three days' journey into the wilderness and sacrifice to the Lord our God as he will command us. So Pharaoh said, I will let you go that you may sacrifice to the Lord your God in the wilderness. Only you shall not go very far away. Intercede for me. Then Moses said, Indeed, I am going out from you, and I will entreat the Lord that the swarms of flies may depart tomorrow from Pharaoh, from his servants, and from his people. But let Pharaoh not deal deceitfully any more in not letting the people go to sacrifice to the Lord. So Moses went out from Pharaoh and entreated the Lord, and the Lord did according to the word of Moses. He removed the swarms of flies from Pharaoh, from his servants, and from his people. Not one remained. But Pharaoh hardened his heart at this time also, neither would he let the people go. Then the Lord said to Moses, Go in to Pharaoh and tell him, Thus says the Lord God of the Hebrews, Let my people go, that they may serve me. For if you refuse to let them go and still hold them, behold, the hand of the Lord will be on your cattle in the field, and the and on the horses, on the donkeys, on the camels, on the oxen, and on the sheep, a very severe pestilence. And the Lord will make a difference between the livestock of Israel and the livestock of Egypt. So nothing shall die of all that belongs to the children of Israel. Then the Lord appointed a set time, saying, Tomorrow the Lord will do this thing in the land. So the Lord did this thing on the next day, and all the livestock of Egypt died. But of the livestock of the children of Israel, not one died. Then Pharaoh sent, and indeed not even one of the livestock of, Israel, of the Israelites was dead. But the heart of Pharaoh became hard, and he did not let the people go. So the Lord said to Moses and Aaron, Take for yourselves handfuls of ashes from a furnace, and let Moses scatter it towards the heavens in the sight of Pharaoh, and it will become fine dust in all the land of Egypt, and it will cause boils and break out in sores on men and beasts throughout all the land of Egypt. Then they took ashes from the furnace and stood before Pharaoh, and Moses scattered them towards heaven, and they caused boils that, break, that broke out in sores on men and beasts. And the magicians could not stand before Moses because of the boils, for the boils were on the magicians and on all the Egyptians. But the Lord hardened the heart of Pharaoh, and he did not heed them, just as the Lord had spoken to Moses. Then the Lord said to Moses, Rise early in the morning and stand before Pharaoh, and say to him, Thus says the Lord God of the Hebrews, Let my people go, that they may serve me. For at this time I will send all my plagues to your very heart, and on your servants, and on your people, that you may know that there is none like me on all the earth, in all the earth. Now if I had stretched out my hand and struck you and your people with pestilence, then you would have been cut off from the earth. But indeed for this purpose I have raised you up that I may show my power in you, and that my name may be declared in all the earth. As yet you exalt yourself against my people in that you will not let them go. Behold, tomorrow, about this time, I will cause very heavy hail to rain down, such as has not been in, e in Egypt since its founding until now. Therefore, send now and gather your livestock and all that you have in the field, for the hail shall come down on every man and every animal which is found in the field and, not brought, and is not brought home, and they shall die. He who feared the word of the Lord among the servants of Pharaoh made his servants and his livestock flee to the houses. But he who did not regard the word of the Lord left his servants and his livestock in the field. Then the Lord said to Moses, Stretch out your hand toward the heaven, that there may be hail in all the land of Egypt, on man, on beast, on every herb, 
of the field throughout the land of Egypt. And Moses stretched out his rod towards heaven, and the Lord sent thunder and hail, and fire darted to the ground. And the Lord rained hail on the land of Egypt. So there was hail and fire mingled with the hail, so very so very heavy that there was none like it in all the land of Egypt since it became a nation. And the hail struck throughout the whole land of Egypt, all that was in the field, both man and beast, and the hail struck every herb of the field and broke every tree of the field. Only in the land of Goshen, where the children of Israel were, was there no hail. And the Pharaoh sent and Pharaoh sent and called for Moses and Aaron and said to them, I have sinned this time. The Lord is righteous, and my people and I are wicked. Entreat the Lord that there may be no more th mighty thundering and hail, for it is enough. I will let you go, and you shall no long you should stay no longer. So Moses said to him, As soon as I have gone out of the city, I will spread out my hands to the Lord. The thunder will cease, and there will be no more hail, that you may know that the, the earth is the Lord's. But as for me, sorry, but as for you and your servants, I know that you will not yet fear the Lord God. Now the flax and the barley were struck, for the barley was in the head, and the flax was in the bud. But the wheat and the, and the spelt were not struck, for they are late crops. So Moses went out of the city from Pharaoh and spread, his, spread out his hands to the Lord. Then the thunder and the hail ceased, and the rain was not poured on the earth. And when Pharaoh, had, and when Pharaoh saw that the rain, the hail, and the thunder had ceased, he sinned yet more, and he hardened his heart he and his servants. So the heart of Pharaoh was hard, neither would, the, would he let the children of Israel go, as the Lord had spoken by Moses. Glory be to the Holy Trinity, our God, forever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Also a reading from Isaiah the prophet. May his holy blessings be with us. Amen. Who has performed and done it, calling the generations from the beginning? I, the Lord, am, am the first, and with the, la and with the last, I am He. The coastlands saw it and feared. The ends of the earth were afraid. They drew near and came. Everyone helped his neighbor and said to his brother, Be of good courage. So the craftsman encouraged the goldsmith. He who smooths with the hammer inspired him who strikes the anvil, saying, It is ready for the soldering. Then he fastened it with pegs that it might not totter. But you, Israel, are my servant, Jacob, whom I have chosen, the descendants of Abraham, my friend, you whom I have taken from the ends of the earth and called from its farthest regions and said to you, You are my servant, I have chosen you and have not cast you away. Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Behold, all those who were incen incensed against you shall be ashamed and disgraced. They shall be as nothing, and those who strive with you shall perish. You shall seek them and not find them, those who contended with you. Those who war against you shall be as nothing, as a non-existent thing. For I, the Lord your God, will hold your right hand, saying to you, Fear not, I will help you. Fear not, you worm, Jacob, you men of Israel. I will help you, says the Lord, and your Redeemer, the Holy One of Israel. Glory be to the Holy Trinity our God forever and unto the ages of ages. Amen.
You have visited them with mercies and compassion, heal them. Lord, have mercy. Remember, O oh Lord, our Father and brethren in our troubling, bring them back to their homes in peace and safety. Lord, have mercy. Eklein, O men, tagnata. Nein, an of noti viot vi pantokrato. Anas to men, eklein, O men, tagnata. Remember, O Lord, the air of heaven and the fruits of the earth, bless them. Lord, have mercy. Remember, O Lord, the waters of the river, bless them, raise them to their measure according to your grace. Lord, have mercy. Remember, O Lord. The seed, the herbs, the plants, and the field of the bread, let them. Lord, have mercy. Eklein, omen, tagnata. Nein, an if not, if you be pantokrato. Nein, an if not, if you pen sotir. Nein, an if not, if you pen sotir. Nein, an if not, if you Remember, O Lord, the salvation of men and animals. Lord, have mercy. Remember, O Lord, the salvation of this holy place and every place and every monastery of our Orthodox fathers. Lord, have mercy. Remember, O Lord, the leader of our land, you serve and keep him in peace, truth, and strength. Lord, have mercy. <laughs> Remember, O Lord, do I in captivity take them all? Lord, have mercy. Remember, O Lord, our father and brethren who have fallen asleep and reposed in the Orthodox faith, report all their souls. Lord, have mercy. Remember, O Lord, who has have brought you these gifts, those on whose behalf they have been brought, and those who have them been brought. Give them all the heavenly reward. Lord, have mercy. <coughs> Remember, O Lord, those who suffer hardship and affliction and distress, save them from all their hardships. Lord, have mercy. Remember, O Lord, the catechumens of your people, have mercy upon them. Lord, have mercy. Confirm their faith in you, approve all traces of idolatry from their hearts. Your law, your fear, your commandments, your truth, and your holy precepts established in their hearts, grant them that they may know the steadfastness of the preaching, and they have received, and in many set time may they be worthy of the washing of the new birth for the remission of their sins, as you prepare them to be a temple of your Holy Spirit. Let everyone pray, Lord, have mercy. Christ our God, who saved us and all the sons of the apostles, many prophets and righteous men, have desired to see the things which you have not seen in them, and to hear the things which you have not heard them. But as you blessed are your eyes, for they see, and your ears, for they hear. May you be worthy to hear and to act according to the Holy Gospel through the prayers of you. Oh, saints, pray for the Holy Gospel, Lord, have mercy. Remember also our Master, all those have been us to remember them in our supplications and prayers, which we offer unto you, Lord, our God. Those who have already fallen asleep, report them. Those who are sick, heal them. For you are the life of a soul, the salvation of a soul. 
the hope of us on the healing of us on the resurrection of our soul. Stand up in the fear of God and listen to the Holy Gospel, a chapter from the Holy Gospel according to Saint Mark. The evangelist, apostle, and pure disciple, may his blessings be with us all. Amen. Be in choice, so open, not to open, so tear, open, or tear in his house, but Christ was a shame if not, and don't keep you on a shiny, pure cup, and not keep it. Books are secret. From the sons of our teacher David, the prophet and king, may his blessings be with us all. Amen. Give ear to my prayer, O God, and do not hide yourself from my supplication. Attend to me and hear me. Who comes in the name of the Lord, our Lord, our God, our Savior, and the King of us all, Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, glory be to you forever. Amen. Then he arose from there and came to the region of Judea, by the other side of the Jordan, and multitudes gathered to him again. And as he was accustomed, he taught them again. The Pharisees came and asked him, Is it lawful for a man to divorce his wife? testing him and he answered and said to them what did moses command you they said moses permitted a man to write a certificate of divorce and to dismiss her and jesus answered and said to them because of the hardness of your heart he wrote you this precept but from the beginning of creation, God made them male and female. For this reason, a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. So then they are no longer two, but one flesh. Therefore, what God has joined together let not man separate. In the house his disciples also, also asked him again about this matter. So he said to them, Whoever divorces his wife and marries another commits adultery against her. And if a woman divorces her husband and marries another, she commits adultery. E, e, glory to you. Jeff Mano and 
Tetreia se gike volte nu oște mostenti o nas. What in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. The Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son and Logos of God, the Father, who has broken every bond of our sins through his saving life giving sufferings, who breathed into the face of his heavenly disciples and apostles, and said to them, Receive the Holy Spirit, if you forgive the sins of any, they are forgiven. If you retain the sins of any, they are retained. Now also, O Master, you have given grace through your Holy Apostle to those for the time labor and priesthood in your Holy Church to forgive sin upon the earth and to bind and lose every bond of iniquity. Now also, we ask and entreat your goodness, O lover of mankind, for your servants, my Father, my brethren, my witness, those who bow their heads before your holy glory, dispense to us your mercy and lose every bond of our sins. And if we have committed any sin against you knowingly or unknowingly, or through anguish of heart, whether in deed or word, or from faith and hardness, O Master, who knows the weakness of men, as a good one and lover of mankind, grant us, forgive us our sins, bless us, purify us, absolve us and all your people, fill us with your fear and straighten us for your holy good will, for our good will, for our devotion, our faith, and all ways, Amen. Vlogies <laughs> And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil through Jesus Christ, our Lord, and bind him forever and ever. Amen. Halal, Muhammad, Allah, Allah, Ibn Ahmad, Allah, Ibn Rahid, Sharika, Gawai, Wa Ba'adai, Tura, Quds, Fartakum, Ma, Jamiakum, Man, Arad, Al, Yawm, Bifal, Yawm, Bifal, Yawm, Bifal, Salam, Wa Rafiqum, Wa Rafiqum. Salam, 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 Salam,
With the help of the Holy Spirit whom the Father will send in my name, he will teach you all things and bring to your remembrance all things that I say to you. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. Not as the world gives do I give to you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. You have heard me say to you, I am going away and coming back to you. If you loved me, you would rejoice because I said I am going to the, to the Father, for my Father is greater than I. And now I have told you before it comes, that when it does come to, come to pass, you may believe. I will no longer talk much with you, for the ruler of this world is coming, and he has nothing in me but that the world may know that I love the Father, and as the Father gave me commandments, so I do. Arise, let us go from here. I am the true vine, and my Father is the vine dresser. Every branch in me that does not bear fruit he takes away, and every branch that bears fruit he prunes, that it may bear more fruit. You are already clean because of the words which I have spoken to you. Abide in me and I in you. Glory be to God forever and ever. Amen. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and your right spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, and do not take your Holy Spirit away from me. O oh Lord, do send down your Holy Spirit upon your Lord, the and our boss, and the third hour. Do not take away from us, O good one. But we ask you to renew him within us, O Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, the Lord, the right and life giving spirit, a spirit of prophecy and justice, a spirit of holiness, righteousness, and authority. O oh, Almighty One, for you are the light of our souls, we give light to every man that comes in the world of mercy on us. Kenin Kai Kestosi on us, Tony on an army. O Theotoko, you are the true vine of the cluster of life. We ask you, full of grace, with the apostles of the salvation of our Lord. Blessed is the Lord our God, blessed is the Lord day by day. He prepares our way for his God of our salvation. Kenin Kai Kestosi on us, Tony on an Amen. O heavenly King, the Spirit of Truth, the Comforter, who is everywhere and fills everybody, you are the treasure of goodness and giver of life. We ask you to graciously come and dwell within us. Purify us from iniquity and save our souls. Look, seven, three, ke, yo, ke, the mati. Lord, abide with us as you did with the apostles. When you gave them your peace, we ask you to grant us your peace, our Saviour. Save us and spare our souls. Kenin kai kestos eon aston eon on amin. Whenever we stand in your holy temple, we are considered as those who abide in heaven. O Mother of God, you are the gate of heaven. Open to us the door of mercy. Holy Immortal was born of the Virgin, have mercy upon us. Holy God, Holy Mighty, Holy Immortal was crucified for our sake, have mercy upon us. Holy God, Holy Mighty, Holy Immortal, who arose from the dead and ascended into the heavens, have mercy upon us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forevermore. Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy upon us. O Holy Trinity, have mercy upon us. O Holy Trinity, have mercy upon us. O Lord, forgive us our sins. O Lord, forgive us our trespasses. Lord, forgive us our transgressions. O God, build those who are sick, heal them for the sake of your holy name. O Lord, repose the souls of those who have passed over to you. O Lord, who is without fault, have mercy upon us, support us, and accept our prayers. For thine is the glory, honor, and true holiness. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, bless us. Amen. Amen. Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, for thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. And seeing the multitudes, he went up on a mountain, and when he was seated, his disciples came to him. Then he opened his mouth and taught them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they shall be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Blessed are those. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called sons of God. Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness' sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you when they revile and persecute you, and say all kinds of evil against you falsely for my sake. Rejoice and be exceedingly glad, for great is your reward in heaven. For so they persecuted the prophets who were before you. You are the salt of the earth, but if the salt loses its flavor, how shall it be seasoned? 
It is then good for nothing but to be thrown out and trampled underfoot by men. You are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill cannot be hidden. Nor do they light a lamp and put it under a basket, but on a lampstand, and it gives light to all who are in the house. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. Glory be to God forever and ever. Lord, on the sixth day, at the sixth hour, you are now to the cross for the sin that Adam dared to commit in paradise. Break the bonds of our sins, Lord Christ, and save us. I cried to the Lord, and he heard me. Lord, accept my prayer and answer my supplication. Him in the evening and in the morning and at noon. Hear my words and spare my soul. O Jesus Christ, our Lord, who is now to the cross at the sixth hour, you mortified sin by the cross. By your death you raised the dead. Man whom you created with your hands who died to sin. O Lord, may all our pains be ended through your life-giving and healing sufferings. May our minds be saved from foolishness and worldly desires to the remembrance of your heavenly laws. Because of our many sins, we are without liberty, pretext, or excuse. We can only plead to you, O Virgin Mary, Mother of God, to pray to whom you gave birth, because your supplications are acceptable to our Saviour. O pure mother, do not turn the sinners back. Plead for them, because he to whom you gave birth is the most for redeemer. He suffered to rescue us, O Lord, we are helpless. We badly need your compassion. Help us for the sake of your glory. God, save us and forgive us our sins for the sake of your holy name. Amen. O Lord Christ, you gave salvation to the whole world. When you spread your undefiled hands on the cross, will these all nations give you praise, saying, Glory be to you, O Lord. O good Lord, we worship you, incorruptible person, praying for the remission of our sins, for you are pleased to willingly go to the cross to rescue your creation from the savior of the enemy. We thank you, Christ, for you filled us all with joy when you came to help the world. Glory be to you. Amen. O Mother of the Lord, full of grace, Virgin Mary, we praise you because of the cross, the cross of your Son. Hate is as fallen and death destroyed. We were dead before, but we have been raised and made worthy to inherit eternal life and to regain paradise. For this we thankfully glorify our mortal Lord Jesus. We honor you, Mother of True Light, and glorify you, O Holy Virgin, Mother of God, for you gave birth to the Savior of the world. He came and saved our souls. Glory to you, our Master and King Jesus Christ, pride of the apostles, crown of the martyrs, blood of the righteous, sentence of the church's remission of sins. We preach our holy truth to the one divinity and worship another. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord bless us, amen. Truly we believe in one God, God the Father, the Pantocrat Lord, who created heaven and earth and all things seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten of the Father before all ages, light of light, true God of true God, begotten not created, O essentially the Father, by whom all things were made, who for us men and for our salvation came down from heaven, who was incarnate of the Holy Spirit and was birth of Mary became man. And he was crucified for us in the Pontius Pilate, he suffered and was buried, and on the third day he rose from the dead according to the scriptures, ascended into the heavens, he sits at the right hand of his Father, and he is coming again in his glory to judge the living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. Yes, we believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the life giver, who proceeds from the Father, where the Father and the Son is worshipped and glorified, who spoke by the prophets, and one holy Catholic and apostolic church, we confess one baptism for the remission of sins, and we look for the resurrection of the dead. Kiri Lord have mercy. 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 Kiri
من الكرام من عمر بن السلوس القدوس الاب والابن والروح القدوس سلاما وبنيانا لكنيسة الله الواحد الوحيد المقدس الانبياء مع الرسولية اذكر يا رب الذين قدموا لك هذه القرابين والذين قدمت عنهم والذين قدمت بواسطتهم اعطهم كل من اجر السماء Blessed be the Lord God forever. Amen. 
Praise the Lord, for you nations. Praise Him, all you peoples, for His mercy is confirmed upon us, and the truth of the Lord endures forever. Amen. Alleluia. Observat vike, yoke, avium ne mati, kenikai, kesto se on astone on on amin. Alleluia. Shlim. Ebi vasat ki estati te. Shvemut <speaking> <speaking> Thank you for everything concerning everything and then everything for you have covered us. Help us, God, with us, accept with us yourself, spare us, support with us, and have brought us to this hour. Pray that God may have mercy and compassion upon us, hear us, help us, and accept the supplications and prayers of his saints for that which is good on our behalf at all times, and make us worthy to partake of the Holy Communion of His Holy and Blessed Mysteries for the remission of our sins. Lord, have mercy. Therefore, we ask for intrinsic goodness, O lover of mankind. Grant us to complete this holy day and all the days of our life, all peace in your fear. All in view, all temptation, all the work of Satan, the counsel of wicked men and the rising up of enemies hidden and manifesting them away from us and from all your people and from this table and from this holy place. But those things which are good and profitable to provide for us, for it is you who have given us the authority to threaten serpents and scorpions. And now for the power of the enemy, lead us to
me your servant, the priest, the deacon, the clergy, and the people, and all my witness. Be absolved from the mouth of the Holy Trinity, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, and from the mouth of the Holy Catholic and Apostolic Church, and from the mouth of twelve apostles, and from the mouth of Walter of God, the Evangelist, Mark of the Holy Apostle, and Matthew, the Patricius, and Zavirus, our teacher, the Spur, the Senate, the Nathan, the Apostles, and Peter, the Holy Mother, and High Priest. Saint John Chrysostom, Saint Cyril, Saint Basil, and Saint Gregory, and from the mouth of the three hundred and eighteen of Saint Mercy, the one hundred and fifteenth Constantinople, and the two hundred of Ephesus, and from the mouth of our Father, the High Priest, Pope Otto the Second, and his partner, our Father, the Bishop of Medea, and from my own mouth, being the least full of glory and all power. Paul, the servant of our Lord Jesus Christ and the apostle who is called and chosen to preach the gospel of God, from St. Paul's epistle to the Romans, may his blessings be with us all. Amen. For if those who are of the law are heirs, faith is made void and the promise made of no effect, because the law brings about wrath. For where there is no law, there is no transgression. Therefore it is of faith that it might be according to grace so that the promise might be sure to all the seed, not only to those who are of the law, but also to those who are of the faith of Abraham. 
who is the father of us all. As it is written, I have made you a father of many nations in the presence of him who he believe, whom he believed, God who gives life to the dead and cause those things which do not exist as though they did, who contrary to hope, in hope believed, so that he became the father of many nations, according to what was spoken, so shall, be, so shall your descendants be. And not being weak in faith, he did not consider his own body already dead, since he was about a hundred years old, and the deadness of Sarah's womb. He did not waver at the promise of God through unbelief, but was strengthened in faith, giving glory to God, and being fully convinced that what he had promised, what he had promised, he was able to to perform, and therefore it was accounted to him for righteousness. Now it was not written for his sake alone that it was imputed to him, but also for us. It shall be imputed to us who believe in him who raised up Jesus our Lord from the dead, who was delivered up because of our offenses and was raised because of our justification. Therefore, having been justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ, through whom also we have access by faith into this grace in which we stand, and therefore in hope of the glory of God. And not only that, but we also glory in tribulations, knowing that tribulation produces perseverance, and perseverance character, and character hope. Now hope does not disappoint, because the love of God has been poured out in our hearts by the Holy Spirit who was given to us. The grace of God the Father be with you all. Amen. The Catholic epistle from our first, from the first epistle of our teacher, St. Peter. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. Beloved, do not think it strange concerning the fiery trial which, which is to try you, as though some strange thing happened to you, but rejoice to the extent that, the part, that you partake of Christ's suffering, that when his glory is revealed, you may also be glad and exceedingly with exceedingly jo- exceeding joy. If you are reproached for the name of, of Christ, blessed are you, for the spirit of glory and of God rests upon you. On their part he is bl- blas- on, on their part he is blasphemed, but on your part he is glorified. But let none of you suffer as a murderer, a thief, an evildoer, or as a busybody, in other people's matters. Yet if anyone suffers as a Christian, let him not be ashamed, but let him glorify God in that matter. For the, look, for the time has come for judgment to begin at the house of God. And if it begins with us first, what will be the end of those who do not obey the gospel of God? Now, if the righteous one is scarcely saved, where will the ungodly and the sinner appear? Therefore, let those who suffer according to the will of God commit their soul to him in doing good as to a faithful creator. Do not love the world nor the things in it, for the world and its lustful desires will pass away, and those who perform the will of God shall abide forever. Amen.
from the acts of our fathers, the apostles, who were invested with the grace of the Holy Spirit. May their blessings be with us all. Amen. Then the Spirit told me to go with them, doubting nothing. Moreover, these six brethren accompanied me, and, went, and, when, and we entered the man's house. And he told us how he had seen an angel standing in his house, who said to him, Send men to Joppa, and call for Simon, whose surname is Peter, who will tell you words by which you and all your household will be saved. And as I began to speak, the Holy Spirit fell upon them as upon us at the beginning. Then I remembered the word of the Lord, how he said, John indeed baptized with water, but you shall be baptized with the Holy Spirit. If therefore God gave them the same gift as he gave us when we believed on the on the Lord Jesus Christ, who was who was I that I could withstand God? When the when they heard these things, they became silent. They glorified God, saying, "Then God has also granted to the Gentiles repentance to life." The word of the Lord shall grow and spread, be mighty and firmly held in the holy church of God. Amen. On this day of the year 1702 of the Martyrs, which is the 25th of March, 1986 AD, the pure Virgin Saint Mary appeared above the church of Saint Damiana in Papadoplo, in Shobra, Cairo, in Egypt. That was in the 15th year of the pontificate of His Holiness Pope Shenouda III, the 117th Patriarch of Alexandria, the apparitions of the Virgin were characterized by it was for thousands of people on the domes of the church and was also marked by the innumerable miracles performed by the Virgin to many without distinction. This apparition also continued for many months. What happened in the church was tangible and gradual in the form of wondrous light of unknown source then the light started to have form and shape the people began to feel the occurrence of miracles and signs around them which confirmed the faith in their hearts this apparition accompanied by some spiritual phenomena as the as the repeated apparition of the virgin in different forms the apparition of pigeons flying at night the smell of incense over the church and a very luminous and radiant unnatural light appearing inside the church towers and also emitted in different places of the church shining to the outside the various news media both foreign and arabic covered this apparition this apparition was confirmed also by a report issued by the special senate committee that was entrusted by his holiness pope shenouda to investigate investigate and verify the facts of this glorious apparition the blessing of the intercession of our lady the virgin saint mary be with us all amen on this day also of the year 483 of the martyrs which is 767 a.d pope michael the first the 46th patriarch of alexandria departed this father was a pious monk in the monastery of saint macarius the great in the wilderness of Shahid, when Pope Theodorus departed, the bishops and priests and lay leaders un un unanimously agreed to choose the Holy Father 
Mikhail el Makari to consecrate him patriarch for what was known of his godliness, piety, and knowledge. They seized Father Mikhail against his will and brought him to Alexandria. They consecrated him patriarch on the seventh, 17th day of Tut, year 460 of the Martyrs, which is 743 AD, by the name of Pope Mikhail I. On the day of his enthronement, it rained heavily for three days after two consecutive years of drought. The people of Alexandria considered that to be a good omen. This pope endured many hardships from the ruler Abdel Malik ibn Marwan, for he was beaten, imprisoned, changed, and tort chained and tortured. When Kiri Kiriakos, king of Nubia, knew that he was extremely enraged and he prepared about 100,000 soldiers and marched towards, towards Egypt. He encamped around El Fustat, threatening to destroy it. When Abdel Malik, the ruler, saw the armies of King Kiriakos and realized that all his had been all this had taken place for the sake of the patriarch he was terrified and released him from prison the ruler entreated the patriarch to mediate a truce between him and the king of nubia the patriarch went out along with some of the clergy to meet the king of nubia and asked him to accept the truce with abdel malik the king accepted his mediation and returned to his country the ruler started to respect Pope Mikhail and lifted up his persecution against his people. Moreover, the Pope prayed for the sake of the ruler's daughter who was possessed with an unclean spirit and with his prayers she was healed. Because of that, the governor increased his respect for the patriarch. When Pope Mikhail completed his good endeavor, departed completed his good de de endeavor and departed in peace. He remained on the apostolic throne for 23 years and six months. The, pr the blessings and prayers be with us all, and glory be to our God forever. Amen. <laughs> Agios, Agios, Yesheros, Agios, Athanatos, O Estabrotis, Dimas, Eleisonimas, Agios, Oteos, Agios, Yesheros, Agios, Athanatos, O Anastasic, Ton Nicros, Kenneth, Ton Yestos, Oramos, Eleisonimas, Jesus Christ, our God, who said to his son, the sons and apostles, many prophets and righteous men, have desired to see the things which you seen have not seen them, and to hear the things which you have not heard them. But as you blessed are your eyes for they see, and your ears for they hear, may you be worthy to hear and to act according to your holy gospels, through the prayers of you. Sense. Remember also our master, all those have been us through the modifications and prayers which we offer unto Lord our God, those who have already fallen asleep before them, those who are seeking them. For you are the life of us all, the salvation of us all. The hope of us all, the healing of us all, and the resurrection of us all. Oh, 
ti te me salvo buceo, a coso mento a gio evangelio. Stand up in the fear of God and listen to the Holy Gospel. A chapter from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke, the evangelist, apostle, and pure disciple. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. From the Psalms of our teacher David, the prophet and king, may his blessings be with us all. I mean, for great is your, worst, your mercy toward me, and you have delivered my soul from the depths of Sheol. Oh God, the proud have risen against me. Alleluia. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord, our Lord, our God, our Savior, and the King of our soul, Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. Glory be to you forever. Amen. He also spoke this parable. A certain man had a fig tree planted in his vineyard, and he came seeking fruit on it and found none. Then he said to the keeper of his vineyard, Look, for three years I have come seeking fruit on this fig tree and found none. Cut it down, why does it use up the ground? But he answered and said to him, Sir, let it alone this year also, until I dig around it and fertilize it. And if it bears fruit, well, but if not, after that, you can cut it down. Ah, 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 glory to you. Ah, 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 Lord, te hiri niente vnoti, te te chosi enos niven, Ese aren ne tenit chen becheres tosi sos ben shois. Aer no fi, aer no vi, beshoisi sos koni evol. Je emmon bo ken ater no vi, je em, o de emmone chois not ko evol. The peace of God which surpasses all understanding will guard your hearts in Christ Jesus our Lord. I have sinned, I have sinned. My Lord Jesus, forgive me, for there is no slave without sin, nor master without forgiveness. Je penio tetchenifio imareftovo en je bekeran. Mare si en je tek metoro, je vok me bio u shaini ene. Je fez marot en je viot ne me pshiri, ne mbem ne ma eto ueb. Te te reia se gi ke vol, te no oshte mos tenti o ones. In the wisdom of God, let us attend. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy in truth. We believe in one God, God the Father, the Pontifat, who created heaven and earth, and all things seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, 
begotten Father before all ages, light of light, true God of true God, begotten not created, for essential with the Father, by whom all things were made, who for us men and for our salvation came down from heaven and was incarnate of the Holy Spirit and of the Virgin Mary and became man. And he was crucified for us in the Pontius Pilate, suffered and was buried, and on the third day he rose from the dead according to the Scriptures. He ascended into the heavens, he sits at the right hand of his Father, and he is coming again in his glory to judge the living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. Yes, we believe in the Holy Spirit, the, the Lord, the life giver, who proceeds from the Father, who with the Father and Son is worshipped and glorified, who spoke by the prophets, and in one holy, catholic, and apostolic church, we confess one baptism for remission of sins, and we look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the coming age. Ah, Oh God, the greed that turned a love for with man in incorruption, and that which entered into the world through the envy of the devil, you've destroyed by the life giving manifestation of your only begotten Son, our Lord God and Savior, Jesus Christ. You have filled that with the heavenly peace. By which the host of angels glorify you, saying, Glory to God in the highest, peace on earth and good. Well, toward man. Pray for perfect peace, love, and the holy apostolic kisses. Lord, have mercy. According to your good will, O God, fill our hearts with your peace, lead us from all blemish. O God, O Lord, put us your craftiness and the remembrance of vice with erring death. And make us, O Lord, your master, to greet one another with holy kiss, that without casting us into condemnation we may partake of your immortal and heavenly gift in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Yes, Lord, who is Jesus Christ, the Son of God, hear us and have mercy upon us. Offer, offer in all the stand with trembling, look towards the east, let us attend. Heat and address the antique, the water court to what Maria, choice are the Mortman. And before a ball and ten and no bit and wash them, Mokoka Teres falls. Then the Kyot and Avatos. And then the Ma et Oat. Jeak Iat Soti Emmon. Ele Os Iris. Esayat. Ele Se. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We have them with the Lord. Let us give thanks to the It is meat and right. Meat and right, meat and right, truly indeed. It is meat and right. 
O you, the big mass, the Lord God of truth, being before the ages and reigning forever, O dwell the lies and looks upon the holy, who has created the heaven, the earth, the sea, and all that is there, and the Father of our Lord God and Savior, Jesus Christ, by whom you have created all things seen and unseen, who is seated upon the throne of his glory and who is worshipped by all the holy power. You who are seated stand before who may stand. The angels, the archangels, the principalities, the authorities, the throne, the dominions. And the powers look towards the east. You are here around home is done. The cherubim full of eyes. And the seraphim with six wings spreading continuously without seething. Saying, let us attend the cherubim worship you, and the seraphim glorify you, proclaiming and saying, Holy, Holy, Holy Lord, Lord of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your holy created us and placed us in the paradise of joy. When we disobeyed your commandment by the deceit of the serpent, we fell from eternal life and were exiled from the paradise of joy. You have not abandoned us to the end, but have always visited us through your holy prophets, and in the last days you manifested yourself to us who were sitting in darkness and the shadow of death, through your only begotten Son, our Lord God and Savior Jesus Christ, who of the Holy Spirit and of the Holy Virgin, Mary. And became man and taught us the ways of salvation. He granted us the birth from right water and his spirit. He made us unto himself and a simple people and sanctified us by Holy Spirit. He loved his own or the world. And the other and summon our behalf gave himself up unto death, which reigned over us who were bound and sold of account for sins. He descended into Hades through the cross. Ascended into the heavens and sat at your right hand, O Father, 
He has appointed the day for recompense, on which he will appear to judge the world in righteousness, and give each one according to his deeds. According to your mercy, Lord, and not according to saying, take, drink of it all of you, for this is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for you and for many, to be given for the remission of sin this, do in remembrance of me. This is also true. Time you eat of these 
breath and drink of this cup. You proclaim my death, confess my resurrection and remember me. Till I come. Amen, amen, amen. Your death, O Lord, we proclaim. Your holy resurrection and ascension into the heavens we confess we praise you we bless you we thank you lord and we entreat you So commemorate his holy passion, his resurrection from the dead, his ascension into the heavens, his sitting at your right hand, O oh Father, and his second coming from the heavens, O oh summon full of glory. We offer unto you your gifts from what is yours for everything concerning everything and in everything. Worship God in fear and trembling. We praise you. We bless you. We serve you. We worship you. Let us attend Amen. Oh, by I came in and the Bible and so my boy been taught. Amen, and survive in so my poor being talk. Valentina, the ordinance of the Tayot and Tainted and Tinkin Valentina. Of sins and eternal life to those 
Oparthi ko bhim Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy Because, O Lord, your master, so partake of your holy zan to the purification of our souls, bodies and spirits that we may become one body and one spirit, and may have a share and inheritance with all the saints who have pleased you since the beginning. Remember, O Lord, the peace of your own Holy Catholic and the Apostolic Church. Pray for the peace of your one Holy Catholic and Apostolic Orthodox Church of God, Lord, have mercy. This which you have acquired to serve with the precious blood of your Christ, keep her in peace with all the Orthodox bishops who are in here. For most remember, O Lord, our blessed and honored Father, the Pope out of the second, and his father, our father, the Bishop of Adanil. Pray for a high priest, Baba Abata, Adros the second, Pope and Patriarch and Archbishop of the great city of Alexandria, and our father, the Bishop and Daniel, and for our Orthodox bishops, Lord have mercy. And those who righteously handle the word of truth with him, grant them and your holy church to shepherd your flock in peace. Remember, O Lord, the Orthodox Higman's priests and deacons. Pray for the Higman's priests, deacons, subdeacons, and the seven orders of the church of God. Lord, have mercy. Mercy. And all the servants and all who are in virgins and the purity of all your faithful people, remember all Lord to have mercy upon us all. Have mercy upon us, God, the Father, the Pantokara. Remember, O Lord, the salvation of this holy place and every place and every monastery of our Orthodox fathers. Pray for the safety of the world and of this city of ours and all cities, districts, islands, and monasteries. Lord, have mercy. And those who righteously under the word of truth with him, and those who dwell in God's faith, <coughs> be glad. Uh, Jane. Yeah.
Graciously accord, O Lord, to bless the air of the heaven, the fruit of the air, the deep of the air. Bless them. Pray for the air of the heaven, the fruits of the earth, the rising of the waters of the rivers, the seeds, the herbs, the plants of the field, that Christ our God may bless them, bring them to perfection in peace without harm, and forgive us our sins. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Praise Him to the Major according to your grace. Give joy to the face of the earth. May its fruits be abundantly watered and its fruits be plentiful. Prepare it for sowing and harvesting. Manage our life as deemed fit. Bless the crown of the year with your goodness, for the sake of the poor of your people, the widow, the orphan, the traveler, the stranger, and for the sake of all of us who entreat you and seek your holy name, for the eyes of everyone waits upon you, for you give them their food in due season. Deal with us according to your goodness. O you who give food to all flesh, fill our hearts with joy and gladness, that we to having sufficiency in everything always may abound in every good deed. Lord, have mercy. Remember all of those who have brought you this gift, those on those behalf they have been brought, and those by whom they have been brought. Give them all the heavenly reward. Pray for these holy and precious gifts, our sacrifices, and those who have brought them, Lord, have mercy. <coughs> and this, O oh Lord, is the command of your only begotten Son, that we share in the commemoration of your sins. Graciously accord, O Lord, to remember all the sins who have pleased you since the beginning 
Our Holy Fathers, the Patriarchs, the Prophets, the Apostles, the Prashid, the Vandal, the Martyrs, the Confessors, and all the spirits of the righteous perfected in the faith most of all. Let pure fall of glory ever, Virgin, only Theotokos and Mary, who truly gave birth to God the Logo. And Saint John, the Pearl of San Matthias, and Stephen, the Archdeacon and Promoter, the Beholder of God, the Evangelist, Mark, the Holy Apostle, and Martyr, the Patriarch, is Saint Severus, our teacher, this chorus, then Athanathid, the Apostle of Saint Peter, the Holy Martyr, and I praise, Saint John, Chrysostom, Saint Theodosius, Saint Theophilus, Saint Demetrius, Saint Cyril, Saint Basil, Saint Gregory, the Theologian, Saint Gregory, the Wonder Worker, Saint Gregory, the Aramani, and the 318 assembled Nicaea, the 150 at Constantinople, and the 200 at Ephesus, our righteous Father, the great of Antony, the righteous of Paul, the three saints of Macari and all their children, the cross bearers, our father of the Hegemon, our righteous father of Apishoi, the perfect man, the beloved of our good Savior, and all the choir of your saints, whose prayers and supplications have mercy on us all. And save us for the sake of your holy name, which is called upon us. Patriarchs who have fallen asleep, our Lord, repose their souls and forgive us our sins. May their holy blessings be with us. Amen. Glory to you, Lord. Lord, have e Lord have mercy Lord bless us Lord repose them Taken report them in the paradise of joy, in the region of the living forever in the heavenly Jerusalem, in that place, and we to our sojourn not in this place. Keep us in your faith and grant us your peace unto the of all ages. Amen. Lead us 
begotten son into the world. He taught us the law and the commandments written in the Holy Gospel. And he taught us the fasting and prayer cast out demons. When he said that this kind cannot come out by anything but prayer and fasting. Fasting and prayer are those which raised Elijah to heaven and saved Daniel from the lion's den. Fasting and prayer are those which Moses pursued until he received the law and the commandments written with the finger of God. Fasting and prayer are those which then in a person so God had mercy on them and forgave them their sins and lifted his wrath away from him. Fasting and prayer are those which the prophets pursued and prophesied concerning the advent of Christ many generations before his coming. Fasting and prayer are those which the apostles pursued, they preached to all nations and made them Christians, baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and 
Compare are those which the martyrs pursued until they shed their blood for the aim of the Christ to confess the good confession before Pontius Pilate. Fasting and prayer are those which the righteous and the just and the cross bearers pursued. They dwelt in the mountains, desert, and holes of the air because of their great love for Christ the King. And we too let us live fast from the all evil. In purity and righteousness, and let us proceed first to this holy sacrifice and partake of it with thanksgiving, so that with a pure heart, an enlightened soul, and an ashamed face, a faith and find the perfect love and firm hope, we may there with boldness without fear to pray to you, God, with the Holy Father on the heavens. And say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, who thine is the kingdom, power and glory forever and ever. Amen. Thank you. 
Remember all Lord our assemblies, bless them. Save by me and renew your spirits in the fear of God, the Pasifin. To me, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. The whole is for the only. Blessed be the Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the Son of is by the Holy Spirit. Amen. One is the All Holy Father, one is the All Holy Son, one is the All Holy Spirit. Amen. So, the holy body and the precious true blood of Jesus Christ, the Son of our God. Amen. Amen. The holy precious body and the true blood of Jesus Christ, the Son of our God. Amen. Amen. The body and the blood of Emmanuel, our God, this is true. Amen. Amen. Tina. I believe, I believe, and confess to the last the bread that this is the life giving flesh that you're only begotten Son, our Lord God and Savior Jesus Christ. So, from our Lady, the Lady of us all, the only thing to consent, Mary, He made it one with His divinity without mingling, without confusion, and without alteration. He confessed the good confession before Pontius Pilate. He gave it up for us up on the holy wood of the cross of his own word for us all truly I believe that his divinity parted not from his humanity for a single moment nor of a twinkling of an eye given for us for salvation, remission of sins and eternal life to those who partake of him. I believe, I believe, I believe that this is true. Amen. 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 
believe, I believe, I believe that this is so in truth. I mean, pray for us and for all Christians who said to us concerning them, Remember us in the house of the Lord. The peace and love of Jesus Christ be with you. Sing Alleluia. Pray for the worthy communion of the Immaculate, Heavenly and Holy Mystery. Is Lord have mercy.
Sumatos kemo tos mono kiste o metano mutsu soto taristi so me luksatte keyo kyaga me mati sumatos kemo tos mono kiste o metano mutsu soto taristi so me kenin kyai kesto se ona stone ona na me vai be mi somene desto te mono geni se noti vai tane che mono ki ko mono che mo te tot mano ki me angelos nemi tamo te vechi se o kuras te te o che bole bole mos Devi tavare ste vinere con le mene hone me mene gua Sho vero che ti stai con la vuole me anno me te ne ton de se de se te ne cho se me mare e so che non ho mai non che le son che le son che ne hanno mi sono a mira smo lo smo lo smo lo tane con le bon bon be e smo e mi non se sho mi Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to do that.